Hello, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to see the course of problem reading. So let's read the problem statement. So staff purchased a new herbicide and now wants to test its effectiveness. So initially there are no weeds in staff's garden. For each i equal to 1 to n, exactly one new weed will pop up in the garden at the start of the day i. Okay. So it is a i less than a2 less than a n. Staff can spray the herbicide at most once per day. So it means that staff can like uh, spray a herbicide only one time. Not it can spray or not, it's a choice, but he can't spray more than once. That is the case. So any weed that receives K spray or more times in total will die. That means there is some spray, uh, some weed that uh, the blood and he need it need k k times like if we spray k number of days spray then it will die so that is the case and we would like to know is it possible that after m days all weeds are gone or not so that is the case so let's see some example quickly so let's see this first example so here n is 3 okay and m is 10 and first that is k so we need k sprays okay so one spray needed so so this is the number of days on which it developed so let's suppose first weed comes on fourth day so it they will spray the herbicide on that day only so it will die it will die okay so next seventh day it will also die they will spray on the same day next weed comes on tenth day okay it will also die because on the m equal to 10 on tenth day we will spray herbicide and the weed will die so let's see this case so it is a good example here you will be clear that how can we solve this problem so here k is 2 okay here k is 2 so what is needed that initially 4 so 2 herbicide 2 spray needed so one we will spray on fourth and another one we will spray on fifth. So two spray, one on this, one on this. So two sprays needed and we have total 10 days. So we can spray till the 10th. So it will die. Okay. Now we have seven. So one spray on seventh day and one spray on eighth day. So this will also die. But this case, on 10th day, one new weed comes. So on 10th day, we can spray one, but it needed two and we don't have 11th day. So it will die. That is the case. So if you can see in the last example, these are all are less than this. So fourth day, needed five. So one will be on four, then another one will be fifth, six, seven, eight and nine. On these days we will spray herbicide and then it will die. So that is the case here. So what we have needed to solve this question. This is very simple question. So let me tell you how can we solve this problem. So for this problem we needed the weed which comes on the last day, the last occurrence of the weed. So the last occurrence of the weed here is 10. Okay. So 10, then we need, we need to add the K. K is something, the number of sprays. Okay. And we will subtract 
one year. Okay, so this will be the quantity. Why minus one? Because they will spray on the day which the weed develop. That is also counted. So we will do minus one, and then we will compare with m, the number of days. If it is this condition, then yes. Else, no. Simple. Hope you understand this solution. Like this video. Subscribe the channel. Thank you.